Hey, this is Timothy, aka Kentucky Fried Nerd here, with another Food Finds. Uh, this is a part of a three-parter that uh, we're calling the St. Louis Airdrop. This will be part one. So, I was informed yesterday at work that uh, one of my best friend's parents uh, was going to St. Louis, coming back, uh, and they were going to be bringing some food, uh, and they wanted to see if I wanted any, of course. Of course, I wanted any because St. Louis is one of the food cities in the United States as far as I'm concerned. And uh, I thought I'd let y'all know a couple of things that they don't show that often on uh, YouTube. The first of which is the Slinger. Now, I have a Slinger, um, one which is mine without egg, and then one which is standard. Now this is similar to the garbage plate in upstate New York, uh, except no, macro, no macaroni salad. What it actually is, typically it is uh, hash brown potatoes, onions, two hamburgers, sometimes one big hamburger, eggs your choice, and delicious sloppy beanie chili all over that freaking thing. So... Since if egg touches my lips, you'll get to see a, a great fail compilation of me throwing up all over the ground. Mine doesn't have any egg in it. That story belongs somewhere else, but anyway. What the fuck are you doing? So what, you're eating my soul. Stop eating my soul with your electronic device. <laughs> Go. All right, so as you can see here, we have um, one cheeseburger, two cheeseburger. Um, if you take the cheeseburger off, you have delicious crispy potatoes that are, that are, it's a couple hours old, but it's been reheated. And I'm not driving all the way to St. Louis tonight for a fucking food, even, even though they would be open. Even though they would be open because Made Right is, uh, Eat Right. Eat Right is the place that we went to or they went to. Eat Right has been open since the 1940s. They are an amazing place. They're on Historic Route 66. I'm going to get a little bite of this and we're going to see, because I have actually never had a slinger, so I'm going to get a bite of burger too. Bite of crispy burger. And... Mmm. Okay, it's a lot of familiar flavors from several different meals meshed into one. <laughs> that just sounded so bad. <laughs> <laughs> That's what it tastes like. I mean, like if you ever thought, I really want like an ice cream sundae, but I also really want waffles and bacon. So why don't I just take an ice cream sundae and put a bunch of waffles and bacon on it? And gravy. It's very, it's not, it's not foods that... You could eat them together like a chili cheeseburger with a side of hash browns. You could do that. But this is right on top. So, Eat Right is on 622 Choteau Avenue in St. Louis. They're right on the corner down the street from uh, the Rallies, Emo's, it's a White Castle, uh, Broadway Oyster Bar, Unk's Barbecue, a lot of nice places. It's really beautiful, little ancient diner. Got a picture right there, so take a look. So, that's my introduction to the Slinger. Um... What did you think about yours that had the egg on it? I liked it with the egg, but I like eggs. Do you think it changed the taste much that it would be without egg or with egg? Do you think it... Um, the egg one definitely had more taste of eggs in it. Well, was it better with the egg, you think, or... I think that depends upon the individual's preference of eggs. If I you enjoyed like eggs. it. Yeah, okay. So, yeah, um, 
Definitely, if you are in downtown St. Louis, definitely go to the Eat Right. They're open 24 hours a day. You'll have to get buzzed in if it's late. But definitely get the sliders. Definitely consider the Slinger. Great stuff. Great chili. Crispy hash browns. Good burger. All around, I would say that is a delicious meal. Unique only to St. Louis. So uh, until then, y'all uh, have a wonderful day. Uh, make sure to subscribe, put down a like, give me a comment, call me a horrible name. I'll smile and swallow it. So have a wonderful day, really. Bye.